More children are getting myopia and at diagnosed, uh, they're being diagnosed at a much younger age. The Singapore National Eye Centre is now seeing kids as young as six years old having to wear glasses. A decade ago, the average age was around 12. High myopia cases over 500 degrees in each eye have almost doubled in the past decade. Sabrina Ang finds out what's causing this trend. Like most children, Nayo Ashagan loves reading and using his tablet. But two years ago, we started to see that he, when he was reading his books, and then he was really trying to screen out, he was like bringing it really close to his eyes. Then we realized that, yeah, it's quite serious. So we took, actually, we took upon ourselves to go and get him checked, even though we know that the schools were having educations about myopia. Uh, but I don't think so. The kids themselves know what myopia is. Asha is among 80% of those 18 years old and below with nearsightedness. Up to 20% of children now have high myopia, compared to just around 10% a decade ago. The Singapore National Eye Centre says major risk factors include increased screen time and the lack of outdoor activities. I think that the pandemic has accelerated the entire uh, situation, right? Because um, Pre, before the pandemic, of course, digital devices were around. But now parents and children are even more comfortable, right? Being on Zoom, being on laptops, uh, being on iPads. And I think that that behavioral change is perhaps a little bit more disturbing and alarming rather than the actual use of digital devices. It could get worse down the road. The condition could lead to complications like blindness and cataracts, which sets in at around the ages of between 30 and 40 years old. But there are ways to slow down its progression. It starts with changing the lifestyle, spending more time outdoors. There are also other solution options in the market today, from optical glasses you know, to, to even uh, myopia control, uh, contact lenses, and even eye drops that are prescribed by the eye doctors. Eyesight tests for those in primary 1 to 4 are currently part of their annual health screenings. It's hoped that those who need vision correction can get it in a timely manner.